Hey Simmers and YouTubers, I thought in this video I would show you guys how to complete some of the Mystery Island update goals since um, the new update has come to Android. As far as I've heard, um, you guys can confirm this. But anyway, um, I'll just show you guys what to do. The first goal is to ponder in a lounge chair. So for this, you guys will just need um, a chair that is a single chair. So you can't use any of the longer couches. You need, um, you need this chair. A single chair and you just click on it and then you press ponder and your sims are just gonna ponder there for a while so um, yeah I'm gonna go through probably the first few goals in this video and then maybe I'll split up the videos into different videos so that um, it won't be too long for you guys but really excited for you guys that you that the update has now come to Android from what I've heard so I have my sim pondering right now um, let's have him finish this task, and then I'll show you guys what the next goal is. So my sim is finishing up pondering in his chair as the first goal for the Mystery Island bridge unlocking. And he's also wearing the fashion designer outfit, in case you guys are wondering what that looks like. This is what the guy's version look lo looks like. The girl's version is really cool, too. So he's done pondering in a chair. The next goal for the Mystery Island update will be to grow some potatoes. So I'm going to bring him outside, and he's going to come to, you guys need to have a garden patch, so make sure you have that, I'm sure you guys all do. So click on it, and you're going to go to potatoes. So I'm going to have him come down. Um, let's see if this other sim is available right now to show you guys. Never mind. Anyway, I'll just cancel this so I can show you guys. This is the other fashion designer outfit, just so you guys know what it looks like. Pretty cool for the girls. But yeah, this is... The other one was for the guys, but I'm having my other sim grow some potatoes. And then we'll come back to her once she's finished, and that this is the second goal. Okay, so she just finished growing some potatoes. We're going to collect those. The icons were a little bit different. So the next goal, the third goal, is going to be to make a double shot of coffee. So we're going to click on that, and then we're going to click a double shot. You can have any coffee machine to do this, but this one is just one of the ones that you could get in the furniture store in the kitchen section. Um, just choose any of the coffee machines. And the coffee machines are... So you go to the kitchen, and then you go all the way kind of towards the end. And then you'll see um, right in the middle right there, the $2,000 and the $4,000 one are both coffee machines. And the seven fifty one. one. You can use any of those to make a double shot. So she's just about to finish. So she just finished some um, making a double shot of coffee. Ignore those icons right now because you don't need those. Those, are, those will come later. The fourth goal in unlocking the bridge is to um, grow some watermelon. Watermelon. So you just click on plant and you click watermelon melons. <laughs> so we're just gonna have her come outside and finish this. For all you Android users, let me know how you like the new update and goals. By the way, these goals don't last forever. They're just here until you finish the update. Um, they're only here until you unlock the bridge and get everything in. So we'll have him grow some watermelon and check up on him later. This is again our fourth goal. Okay, so he just finished growing some watermelon. That was our fourth goal. And then our next goal is going to be to use the microwave. Our next goal is to make some hot snacks in the microwave. So we're going to have our sim come to the microwave and make some hot snacks. So you see the option at the bottom. So we'll make him come here. And um, you guys do need, or her, whoever's available. So for this goal, you just need to make sure you have a microwave and you pretty much just go to the kitchen section. Again, go all the way to the end if you guys don't have a microwave already. Um, and it's one of the eight, it's either the 800 or the 3000 or the six lifestyle points for the microwave. So she's just finished making it and she's eating it right now. And for the previous goal, if you guys don't know where the garden patch is, I'm sure you guys all do, but it's outdoors, and then you go to plants, and then it's a $20 thing, it's the garden patch. So we'll have her finish up, and then again, this is the fifth goal. 
Our next goal is to catch some Z's on a couch. So that's our sixth goal, I believe. I'm getting this off the forums, so hopefully this is right. So we're going to go to a couch, and it's any couch that you guys have. Whether it be a long one or a, a regular one, I'll go upstairs. You can just use one of these. And then it's um, catch some Z's, so it's going to take three hours. So just have your sim get started on it, and they're going to catch some Z's. And again, you can use either this couch or that couch. It doesn't really matter. And yeah, you can't use the lounge chairs, but you can use either the three-seater couch um, or the two-seaters. So we're just going to have him catch some Z's, and we're going to come visit. This is the sixth goal for the Mystery Island update. So our next goal is to buy some seeds from the supermarket, and in order to do this, we have to go into neighborhood mode. So let's go into neighborhood mode, and you have to make sure that your your supermarket is built. So if you guys don't have it already, it should be right here, right next to the auto dealership, right next to your party boat, right next to the other stuff around it, which is the competition center and the nightclub. And yeah, that's pretty much the area that it's in, but you'll see it right here. You just click on it and build it if you don't have it already. So it's going to take a while to build, and then once you build it, what you do is you're just going to click on any of these. So you can buy any of these items in the garden. These all count as seeds. So for example, if you buy um, any of these items, whether it be bell peppers, which is free, or carrots or corn, if you guys don't want to waste money, just buy bell, bell peppers. And that's seeds for you. So that's how you get seeds. This is the seventh goal. So the next goal is to take a quick dip in a bathtub. So this is another house. So let's go to the bathtub. Um, and then we're going to have our sim take a quick dip. So just click on that and then take the quick dip. Um, you guys should all know where the bathtub is. You just go into the furniture store, furniture section, go to the bathroom. And then for the bathtub, it's any of the stuff that's a bathtub. Um, so any of the items all the way in the back area you can use. So any of these, any of these items you can use. And just click on it and have her take a bath or him. Um, this one has a floating ducky in it. So we'll visit her once she's done. This is the next goal for the unlocking the bridge. So our next goal would be to negotiate with a sim eating plant. And in order to do this, let's call our sim over and you just pretty much need a garden patch and you're going to click on it and go to any item that you can plant that has that warning sign, the green triangle with a plant with teeth on it. So you want to plant any of those and there's a few of them that you can choose from. But the easiest one to do would just be to do the lettuce because that takes the least amount of time. So you just have him plant it. This is my pirate. I'm having him ready for the Mystery Island adventure. So just have him plant it and wait until it's done. So when he's done, you can click on this and then the sim eating plant should show up. Let's have him come back. Let's have, where is our sim going? Anyways, um, you pretty much, so you just click on it and then click negotiate. And it's going to take three minutes. Your sim won't be eaten or anything, but it will take three minutes. And then that's how you negotiate with the sim eating plant. I guess it's a different sim, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter which sim negotiates. So just have him do this for three minutes. Our next goal is going to be to bake some donuts. So for this, you can use any sim and you just need to get a stove and you click on it. And then you will scroll down to find the donuts. Um, it's the one that says donuts and it has a fire sign, so you just click on it um, and then wait for it. In order to get the stove, in case you guys don't know, just go to the furniture store, go to the kitchen area, which is this one, and then scroll all the way to the end and you'll see a bunch of stoves that you can choose from. So any of these, ranging from the 350 simoleon to the 7500 simoleon. So choose any of those and then have any of your sims. This is my pirate sim. I have him ready to go on an adventure on the mystery island. So just have him bake some donuts and come back once they're done. I think it is, yeah, about eight hours. So just come back in eight hours. So once he's done with that, you can hopefully not get fire. Well, anyway, if you guys do get a fire, just extinguish it. It's not a biggie. So just have him extinguish the fire. And then our next goal, the last goal to unlock the simoleon sprout is your simoleon sprout should be unlocked at this point so our next goal our final goal would be to plant the simoleon sprout for um the mystery island bridge unlocking the bridge so you can um have an adult sim come here and then this would be available now 
is the simoleon sprout so you can just click on that and then it automatically just shows up where you could it's like an automatic um, instant thing where you can just press play and then you'll get your results really quickly you don't have to wait any amount of time to see what you get um, so you just wait and then it shows you what you won that is our first set of goals for unlocking the bridge for the mystery island update